What's up, Cloud Resident? This is Dr. Light here. Welcome back to the 11th episode of the Golden Silver Versus, and I'm always joined by Risky Rufflet. Oh, Risky! Oh, gosh, that was a noise. I couldn't tell what that was. <laughs> All right, so, so we're going we're gonna to go ahead and say go. Three, two, one, go. And uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed these, uh, blah, 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 this series so far, because it is just, it is something else. Also, I have, I have, like, no support. <laughs> I, I've, like, looked through the comment section. It's like, I hope Risky catches up. And I'm like, oh, okay. I see how it is. <laughs> and they're like, oh, how come you're still behind? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I'll let him win. I mean, if you want the real reason, I can tell you what it was. <laughs> Cough. It was whenever you stopped to grind. That That's what it was. That's what did you in. Yeah, I went out of order and then stuff, but I'm fighting your mascot right now. Ooh. Poly World. I'd have the fly. The fly oh, looks so good. In I know, right, doesn't it? Like, you just, like, turn in those little, like, balls and you just, like, fly up. It's like uh, Dragon Ball Z when they teleport. Oh my gosh, where can I buy an escape rope in this game? <laughs> it should be at the Mart. I, I've been to three marts already. Uh, maybe try Goldenrod? That's a good point. Yeah, they have the big department store. I'm setting up. It's... I just don't want to sit and, like, try to figure out how to get out of the Whirl Islands whenever I get Lugia. Oh, yeah, I forgot you're getting Lugia this episode. It's gonna be oh. wild. Oh, yeah. Cheeky. Uh, yeah, switch. switch. So, uh, I was watching an intro moment of one of your more recent series, and I found out that you can sing. <laughs> Only a little. I mean, I'm not good, good, but. I mean, whenever you compare to someone like me who has the voice of a dying <laughs> sea cow, you know, it's, it's, it's pretty good, you know. <laughs> I guess I appreciate it. Hey, I mean, you know, the pe the people want to hear what they want to hear, and I'm sure you got a lot of compliments on that episode, you know. Of course, of course, as a way. I mean, it could be you just have a supportive fan base, or it's you know, you're you're just that good, you know. <laughs> it could be both. It could be both. Nah, it has to be one or the other. It can't be both. <laughs> Uh, but I'm having fun playing, like, Super Mario 64, so now I'm gonna start, like, streaming that on Saturdays, stuff like that. So, yeah. I need to start streaming in general. Yeah, it's fun. Oh, this train has a ho -oh. You know, I wonder if you can explain this to me. Do you understand why streaming is so popular? Um, I believe it's because... Okay, so, like... How do you, when you start streaming, like, if you, if you, like, you just started out and you just get, like, I don't know, one subscriber and start streaming, I don't think anyone's gonna watch it. But, you know, if you have a, if you build up a, a good, like, fan base or a, a community, like, I have, streaming's gonna be good. Like, if you see the views are, like, I don't know, 70 and everything like that, and then you do streaming, <laughs> you know, it's, it just works with the analytics of how good your videos, uh, do compared to everything else and because like people leave and come back to the stream all the time like the views increase as well as, as well as uh watch time like uh my leaf green the episode two that got like 200 views so and 24 likes and it's just because people coming back and forth but it was a very long stream it's like three hours and people can also go back and watch it so you get more watch time as well if you want to like be monetized as well so it's best to both worlds <laughs> uh so i i have already gotten completely lost in uh the whirl islands oh i did not consider getting uh what's the move uh waterfall and i'm just i'm so lost that's that's tough 
Oh my 34. gosh, I literally found Lugia. Yeah. <laughs> Is there a counter? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> oh my gosh, my Lugia is a Mewtwo. Ooh, okay. Oh Cap. Bro, we got that Master Ball. <laughs> You're not even gonna attempt it? No. First of all, uh, this Master Ball is green in this game. Interesting. Yeah, it's very weird. I I want you to know, like, just, I was walking literally in just pure darkness, just bumping into everything. I had no idea what to do. <laughs> All I have to do is go in the tower. <laughs> yeah, you you tell me that whenever you're going through those long puzzles and teleporters and see how you feel. Man, I'm gonna get through it first try. Uh-huh. I'm, I'm gonna have to watch back the episode to check on that, because, like, I, I, I don't <laughs> think so. I don't think so. <laughs> Based on my uh, puzzle knowledge, you know. I'm what, you, what what knowledge are you talking about? What what puzzle knowledge? <laughs> oh my god. That's lit. My Mewtwo was holding an escape rope. <laughs> That's perfect. Also, he has garbage moves. Does yours that... have psychic? Um I have to check, hold on. I think it does, but I think even though I haven't checked his moveset for a while, I don't think it learns it for a while actually. It's kind of lame. A bit of bad. Oh, that was such a good lunch. Oh, you're gonna talk about your lunch now? Yes, I had some ramen noodles with some. Uh. <gasps> Oh, ho, 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 ho. my God. Self-destruct and left Jenny on one. J Jenny's your Pidgeot, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Um. Anyways, <laughs> um, <laughs> my lunch, I had some Robin, and I put a little bit of spices, uh, some cayenne pepper, some season, and then I added some parsley, not parsley, I added some kale, some fresh kale, cooked kale, um, some shrimp, and two boiled eggs. Hmm, okay, okay. I see you, I see you. Yeah, that was pretty bomb. I... I got the basement key. I'm gonna go heal before anything else happens. That was increasingly bad. Alright, let me check my Mewtwo. Uh... Step. I don't... Psychic, does it? I'm really trying to decide it if I... It has confusion. Okay. Have psychic. Okay, so that means mine will still learn psychic right now. Okay, so my Mewtwo has Sacred Fire, Barrier, Swift, and Bubble Beam. Do I teach him Confuse Ray? Sacred Fire, Bubble Beam, and what? Barrier and Swift. D Confuse Ray for Swift, maybe? Do you think I need Barrier more than I need Swift? I mean, if you're really gonna strategize, but I don't really think you're gonna strategize, so maybe take away Barrier, actually. Yeah, because it is a Mewtwo, you know? He's just gonna destroy everything. True, true. I like this. I have four level 40s and then two level 5s on my team. Oof. Great. What I'm talking about. Now I get to go fight the Elite Four. Oh my god. I know, right? It's crazy. I still gotta take another badge on. Get my That's legendary. Fine. Fine. You'll you'll get through that this episode. You'll bet. <laughs> I'm so full, I'm about to like hurdle. <laughs> Did you say hurdle or hurl? Hurl. Hurdle? Okay, okay, I don't okay. even know what I said. <laughs> I, I, I mean, maybe you're at hurdle. You know you're going to get get on the track. You know you're going to jump over those fence gate things. 
people tell me I should do hurdles, but I'm like, eh, I, I don't, like, I'm pretty solid on jumping. I, I got a good vertical jump, but I'm scared to jump on hurdles because those are a little bit, I don't know. <laughs> I literally, like, blew up my knees from soccer, and I feel like there's, like, no muscle there anymore. So jumping is just, like, out of the question at this point. <laughs> it's rough, I used to man. play soccer one time. One time you were, like, eight. No, when I was like a freshman. Bro, why didn't you stay with it? Soccer's where it's at. I did like it, and I wanted to continue it sophomore year, but then, um, cause like in summertime is like tryouts and stuff like that. Yeah. So yeah. summertime was like, um, my mom planned this entire vacation for me. So I went to Disneyland, Florida, Texas, and everything else in Africa, I think too. So I didn't really have time, and when I came back. The trials were like the day of, and I was like, uh, <laughs> I played soccer in a week. I don't know if I could try out. So, all right, that's pretty fair. I'll definitely, definitely give you that. Yeah, but like some of my teachers, like, well, you, why don't you just ask them? I mean, you could have just told them that you're on vacation, and then, you know, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, well, I didn't think about that. All right, I thought it was just, I was just gonna be cut immediately because I'm like coming at the day of, I don't know. Like, I thought you were saying, like, more because, like, technical skill, like, it just wouldn't be there right now. Yeah, I mean, I, I was just, like, my first time playing soccer, but everyone in, like, middle school told me, like, oh, you'd be good at soccer because you're so athletic, do this and this, and I was like, all right, I'm gonna try soccer, and, you know, I was pretty decent. I made it to the JV team, and, no, I was on the practice team for a while, and then I made it to the JV team. He doesn't really, like, cut people. He's like that coach that'll pull like people on the practice team and then they're like, he do, he's not a person to cut people. So it was like, I could have, but you know, I didn't. <laughs> hey, I mean, you know, I think you found something that you like doing now. So it's all good. Yeah, it was fun to uh, try. The 30 minute, <laughs> we did 30 minute runs without stopping. I was, oof. I was already prepped for that after a few years of cross country. Ooh, I can never run. I don't know. Reasons why my knees are destroyed. Cross country, track, soccer. <laughs> it's awful. Like sometimes when I'll do like bend over and do like squats and it's just like my knees want to just give out on me. <laughs> Oh, no, fly isn't uh, what I said. It, it's like you go up in a beam of light, basically. Uh... It's like aliens are abducting you. Just <laughs> pew! Choo, choo, choo. Aliens confirmed right. in the Pokemon universe? <laughs> Facts. I actually kind of want to make a video about something like that because there are Pokemon like uh, Clefairy and Deoxys. They really have not explained. They're just like, yeah, they're not from this planet. They're just from somewhere. Yeah, and I think there's another mod from Black and White. I forgot its name. It starts with e. That one's kind of strange, too. Oh, yeah, I know. The, yeah, that. Uh, mm, gosh, I can see it <laughs> in my head right now. It's uh, the, uh, the, uh, the Elgium one. Elgium. LGM, alright. LGM and, uh, <laughs> Behem. Yeah. They're both Those like... Those are weird mods. Kind of like how the Reggies are, but the Reggies are definitely from here. Yeah. Right, let's see. Uh... Uh, I swear, every time I make videos with you, I think I'm just the, most, the funniest person, but I think you're just really easy to amuse... I guess. I mean, I'm just saying, you know, like, I feel like I'm just, like, ma you're just laughing all the time because I'm making all these dumb comments, you know? You know, I'm just, uh, I'm just a happy, joyful self, you know? I laugh at everything, probably. If you didn't have just, like, a PG channel, I'm sure you'd laugh all the time, you know? <laughs> I already want to go to bed, and it's only like five o'clock. Same. 
Oh my god, someone in my stream the other day, I think it was yesterday, um, they were like, are you sure you're a girl? <laughs> I'm like, are gee, you sure? I don't know, let me look underneath. <laughs> are you sure? That was like the second time I got asked that by someone, I was just like, um, <laughs> gee, my birth certificate says F, not M, like, hello? You know, speaking of that, um, you should uh, plug that uh, da, 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 that goal you made. What goal? The one you made literally earlier today. Oh! There you go. On the Discord. Oh! See, I don't think this is, it's going to be easy. So I'm saying three, 350, I'll give like the Instagram, because I got pictures on Instagram as well. And I'll do a face reveal. But it's too easy now, because I'm like... 320 right now and we're only 30 away so i i don't know i gotta maybe i have to up the goal to like 400 or 500 at the end of the month i don't Man. know right now you're making them want it real bad <laughs> <laughs> they gotta earn it oh my gosh since i have to make sure <laughs> I don't know though. I I think like another thirty subscribers by the end of the month is you know it it it's a lot. Yeah. That's like half of my base right now. I mean, you're doing pretty solid. You're almost at like set. I think you're at like sixty one right now. Yeah, I mean the the growth is real. Like since I've came back in like last like three four months, it's gone up by like fifty, and that's like really nice considering how small I was. So it it it's been nice. go just like finding new people to work with though is so hard sometimes yeah you gotta reach out you gotta reach hard sometimes because <laughs> like i don't really like just leaving like comments on someone's video i want to get like a, a more personal touch with them you know yeah and jumping in their live streams and just kind of, you know, talking to them isn't the best. True. I just realized that my starter cloud, my polytoad, is a girl. <laughs> I didn't even know that. That's probably why they evolved into polytoad, right? <laughs> That's an interesting question, actually. If the gender of the poly world is male, would it evolve into poly wrath? It makes sense. So. And 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 we know they evolve by water stone and king's rock normally, but like with the randomizer the way it is, that's a good question. Oh my gosh, there's so many trainers on the way here. Oh, they are. Oh, you got victory room. No, I haven't even gotten there yet. <laughs> That's wrong. There's so many unavoidable trainers on the way there. Have you, like, made it to the 8th gym city yet? No, I'm still trying to figure out... Uh, okay, is this... Is it... Are you still on the ice path? No, I'm still on the Team Rocket stuff. Oh, okay, no big deal. You're, you'll be done with that soon. Wait, are you messing with the switches right now? Yeah, I'm trying to, like, figure it out. How to, um... You no, know, because, like, I already got the key slot thingy or whatever. Yeah. The key card. I just don't know where to go. You're heading the right way, I'm fairly confident. Because you gotta get past all those switches and fight whoever is down there. I, I don't even remember who. Oh, yeah, I have to go over there, and now I know where to go. Okay. I think Gen 2 probably had, like, some of the least memorable actual people in it. Yeah. Like, the admins for uh, Team Rocket. Yeah, everyone remembers that it was Team Rocket. They just don't actually know who they were. Let's see. So, do you think you're going to make this comeback? Hopefully. Um, but, you know, 
Uh, I'm betting on it. I'm betting. It. All right, all right. I mean, never, never count yourself out. You know, Some, something can always happen. Uh, you know, something's gonna happen on your side, but you know, <laughs> exactly. I think I'm doing pretty solid. <laughs> you know, like maybe, maybe, uh, maybe a Mewtwo comes out on the other side. You know. Yeah, maybe. Maybe a Zapdos and a ho -Oh again. <laughs> hey, I took down both of those. <laughs> T-Tar and all. Oh my gosh, let's calm down. <laughs> uh, I remember that in like the first three episodes. That was... It was ridiculous. They were, they were just throwing stuff at me. It was too early for that. <laughs> I mean, like, the fourth gym, there's, like, every gym leader needs to have a legendary to fight me, and it's like, cool, great, thanks. <laughs> but you know what? I, I prevailed, and, uh, I, I, I got this lead right now. Yeah, I guess for now. That's what I said for now. I'm, I'm, I'm not counting anyone <laughs> out. I'm just trying to keep my pace and keep going. Yeah. Because I don't know anything about going through Kanto. Yeah, Kanto is just so... I literally haven't played through Kanto since the uh, remakes came out, and I played through that. I played just yesterday, till I rage quit. <laughs> you were playing it yesterday? I was playing, uh, I was playing Leaf Green, but like... Oh, okay, okay. Wait, why'd you rage quit Leaf Green? Oh, right, you were doing the 20% boost. And it wasn't even, like, that wasn't even the main problem. Like, our levels were fine. We were just above level. Like, there were 17, we are like, 23. And we just died to, like, absolute bull. It was just poison after poison, or it was, like, Parasong. And I was just like, oh. wow. what is this, you know? Wow. That's pretty great. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I kind of want to do like a more casual live stream at first, you know, like kind of get into the mindset and then do a series or something like that. Yeah, I mean, we beat our Sapphire one, which was pretty calm, you know, we only reset it three times because I didn't randomize it correctly the first time in the first stream. So then, yeah. Nice. Other than that, only had like six deaths. Oh, Quasar. <laughs> I found a wild Articuno. Ooh. Is that your encounter? Nope. It was my second encounter. Rip. <laughs> but its sprite looks pretty lit in this game, just saying. Uh, yeah, it looks nice. I think I just need to see Moltres now, and then I'll see all the birds. Oh. So I do want to throw something out there for uh, a way for you to catch up, potentially. Okay. All right. So you should skip your legendary and go straight to the Elite Four, beat them, and then go back and... No, then go to the Whirl Islands and catch the Lugia. That requires a lot of work. It does, but the Lugia, I think, will be level 70. Uh, that seems like it's gonna kill me. I don't know. Really That's why you save your Master Ball. I don't know about that. I mean, personally, I would research that before, because I, I don't know if I'm 100% right, but still. Didn't Charles do? Let's switch. Uh... If that boy was a uh, Mewtwo level 70, then you would just blow through the rest of the game with your two, three legendaries, however many you have at this point. <laughs> just have like three Mewtwo's, two Mewtwo's, and a freaking Celebi. Hey man, you know, if that gets you through the game, that gets you through the game. I'll just solo run with that. That'd be crazy. I mean, you don't need anyone else. <laughs> I'm just kind of going through the game with a few Mon right now that I've had pretty much since the beginning. Yeah. Can't wait until my room gets fixed. Uh, oh, yeah, your, didn't, was it your roof that fell in? 
Yeah, like the ceiling part of it. You can hear the wind from outside. Jeez. Not that bad. I mean, is it cold there too? Because it's like dropping temperature here. Yeah, it is, it is kind of cold in there. Because ceiling. <laughs> I mean, I guess you could just use like a space heater, I think. Would that even work? Like, I mean, we had problems before with heater, but like, I have heaters. I think I'll. I still sleep downstairs. Uh, that's true. Sleeping downstairs actually would work pretty well, though. The problem is, I wake up in like sweats. I don't know what my dreams is. Well, my dreams are just like really like they're not like I wouldn't say they're scary, but they're, like I guess they stress me out a little bit that I'm sweating. I just get hot whenever I sleep, so if I don't have a fan going, I'll get sweat no matter what. It's really dumb. Like I can like take a nap or something with uh, like pants on and a blanket on. But as soon as I need to fall asleep, I'll get into, like, more comfy clothes, like shorts and stuff. And then I can't sleep because my body just overheats for no reason. Same. It's terrible. It's terrible. Still on it. So, are you still on that Team Rocket hideout? I am, uh, in the Switch area right now. And I'm battling this trainer who has a poor gun. Is it the last trainer, at least? It is the first trainer. <laughs> I really hope you get those switches first try. Thank you. It's such a oh my god! Power. Ugh, <laughs> this is the most annoying Porygon too. Defense curl recover. Please, just just stop. Side beam. That thing's level thirty and it still has defense curl. You know, that's actually the crazy thing. This, the Pokemon I'm battling right now are all only in their 30s. Like, their low 30s. That's... that's... Yeah. Team Rocket people I mean, are like 30s right now. Exactly, exactly. They have 30s. Claire had a 40, and they drop it back down to 30. Levels are so weird in this game. Facts. This too. Ugh, I hate Porygon too. I need mean, different. <laughs> yes. The frustration is really fun. And you confuse horse to us. Oh. The only game I ever really get frustrated at that I play right now is um, Smash Bros. <laughs> I'm just too competitive of a person to lose in certain ways. Yeah. I am absolutely terrible at that game. I played it once and I was, uh, I got destroyed. Because I didn't know how to <laughs> I didn't know how to double jump, so I was clicking the wrong button. That, that's like everyone <laughs> who picks it up that first time, you know? It's just... God! Uh, this is. Are you gonna make it through it? Um, hopefully. How many yeah. mints are we on right now? We're at like thirty, I think. I yeah, we're we're coming. pushing thirty right now. So like. All right. I was I'm catch uh, a surf and. Wait, what are you catching? Oh, catch I'm the surf. Like... Gotcha. Yeah, I'm talking to this Porygon too, because it just keeps recovering. Come on. I'm gonna be here all day. Uh, if you want, we oh. can uh, call it after that battle you're doing. Yeah, we can, we can definitely do that. Alright. I'll go heal and everything. Potions off. I'm just kind of uh. making my way through uh, Victory Road now. Recover! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh, I just found an upgrade. The thing for Porygon, too. 
<laughs> I'm gonna punch my screen. Of course, you're going for agility. What is this strat right now? Oh um, my, wait, is, he's, he's that's three moves that don't do anything. Uh, I found a water oh stone, God. finally! <laughs> <laughs> that's... Uh, I gotta charge my laptop. Uh, okay. Save it. Just some time. <laughs> okay. Sir, please. Hello, hello. Yeah. Yeah. One more. One side game. Side game. We're good. We can do this. One more. Come on, Cell. Kill this Porygon. <clears throat> Finally. After a good solid. Ah. Uh, Good job. Still has one more mod. Freaking Golbat. Freaking Golbat. Oh my gosh. Oh, ancient power. I should kill. <laughs> we did 50%? Wing attack? No, 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 Okay, okay. I outspeed. If I go, no, I'm not, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. No. Who's next? We have next. I can go. I've ever had such a good time with this. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go to Jenny. I think I'm gonna go to Oh my god. You wing attack. Oh uh, did you much? Uh we're gonna go for strength. Come on. Please kill. Please kill. It's so, it's so, it's so close. Oh my god. It's so Jeez. Okay. We have speed, we have speed, we have speed. <sighs> gonna have a heart attack. What the heck is this? Finally, I'm here through Dr. Cloud. I only fought my rival. That's all. Unbelievable. Uh, I didn't even battle. Are you good? I was only battling my rival, aka you, and I couldn't even get through. Oh my crud. I'm fighting a Wobbuffet right now, and he's so scary. Ooh, careful. Destiny Barn. I just can't hit it with a lot right now. Oh, that's right. This game has this weird counter mechanic where, like, if you use an item, then he can still counter you. That's right. Do you have a, like, uh, you got rid of barrier? Yeah, I did. Like, who's on your team? Well, like, right now I just have my Mewtwo fighting him, because, you know, you... Wait, no, you can switch out, because abilities aren't a thing yet. That's right. Yeah. Heal. Get some... It's all good. I should be able to take care of this. I mean, I think you have... It does Mewtwo learn a bite. No, but I'll use Sacred Fire on this Wobbuffet. And hopefully it'll die. Okay, it died. We're good. Alright. I'm just uh, gonna finish up this battle with my rival. And uh, then we'll call it. Alrighty. So just uh, awesome. keep, keep uh, going around, you know, do your thing. Ugh, got it. Barely made it out of there. No potions. <laughs> maybe, I some... maybe you should buy some potions. That's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> That's a really like uh, Captain Hindsight thing, you know. Uh, you don't have any potions. Maybe you should buy some potions. <laughs> hey, look. Uh. What a day to be alive. My rival has like a bunch of really annoying Pokemon for me to fight. Yeah. Well, he had the Wobbuffet. He also has a Hypno. I just I I don't like fighting these Mon. Like they're they're annoying. Yeah, doesn't it have a, a hypnosis? I mean, more than likely, I would assume. That. 
see if I can switch. Right. Just call me a victim. I mean, you are a victim. <laughs> Especially if you lose, you're very you much see? a victim. I guess, but you know, it's not gonna happen. Uh, my team is pretty sad. Uh, didn't didn't you just get, get really close to losing to a Porygon two? <laughs> Porygon two ain't nothing. You know, it was just a, a a matter of just not having potions to heal. You know, if I had potions, I'd be chilling. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't. I don't speak urban urban <laughs> slang. <laughs> Let's... All right, here we here we go here we go. This is what I'm looking for. We're fighting a haunter. Haunter's gonna get blown away. But master ball, light ball. Ooh, look how close you were. <laughs> okay, I have now beaten my rival. Hey. All right, so we're gonna call it right here, and then we're gonna go right into another one. So guys have enjoyed this very nice episode that we made just for you just for you people then you should follow up with the series on friday on risky's channel and we'll see you over there then bye guys peace